you can discuss with your registered dietitian how often you should be seeing him or her face to face. In our clinic here at Northwestern, when someone's starting on the diet, we like to, I like to spend an hour with them really going over their diet and coming up with a game plan for them. Within two, two to three weeks of being on the elimination diet, I like to have my patients follow up with me by phone or face-to-face -face or by email to let me know how they're doing, how stable their weight is. I also like to have them record what they're eating for a couple of days and send it to me so that I can take a look at it and evaluate it nutritionally. I'm looking at two things there. I want to make sure they're getting enough to eat. I want to make sure their, their diet is balanced and that there's no obvious allergens present that maybe they have missed. Uh, after they have a follow-up endoscopy several weeks later, I like to see them again. So three to four times I'm typically working with my patients either face-to-face -face or by phone. Um, some of our patients have family members with food allergies and are very accustomed to allergy-free eating. Other patients that we have are very new to this and you know, require a little bit more phone time or face-to-face -face follow-up to be able to answer questions. But one thing that's really important that I encourage my patients to do is make sure anytime they have a question about a food product or uh, questions about their own diet or how they're feeling on the diet, that they have an open pathway to be able to get those questions answered whether it's with their registered dietitian or with their gastroenterologist or their office nurse.